This video is for people that are using Windows 7 operating system and want to verify that their USB microphone is working properly. So let's get started. I need you to first open up your control panel window. To do this, go ahead and click on your start button located in the bottom left hand corner of your screen and click on the word control panel. Once that window appears, it might look different than mine. That's okay. If you notice over in the right hand corner, we have options to view by. Mine is set to small icons. Yours might be set to categories. But let's go ahead and make sure your setting is at small icons for this demonstration. Now all your settings are listed in alphabetical order. The one that I need you to click on is the word sound. Once you've gone there, go ahead and click on it. This will now open up the sound window. Now you can see we have four tabs. We have the playback tab, the recording tab, the sound tab, and the communications tab. For this demonstration, we're going to focus on the recording tab, so go ahead and click on that. Now again, it might look a little bit different than your computer, but what we want to focus on and what we want to see is Cyber Acoustics USB headset, or if you're using a standalone microphone, Cyber Acoustics USB device. We want to make sure that is listed in this window. If it's not listed in the window, then the device has not been installed properly on your computer. So you might want to check your computer manufacturer to find out the reason why. If you see this, then let's go ahead and continue on. Now, notice over in the right hand corner we have a volume bar. And you can see the green bar jumping up and down as I speak to you. It's not going crazy off the top nor is it not moving at all. It is set to the proper level and it is working properly based on what we are seeing there. You will also notice that my USB headset is the default device. So that lets me know that the computer is set to receive the audio or the voice from the USB headset. It is not set to receive it from a different device such as a microphone, or a Bluetooth or a line in. Now if your microphone from a regular headset is set as your default device as I'm doing right now you would see a green check here and not a green check by the USB. The computer would not recognize the USB microphone because it thinks you want to use the regular microphone. So to change over just go ahead and highlight on the microphone hit USB right click and set that as the default device and you will see that the green check goes back to where you want it to be. Now to adjust the sound levels go ahead and click on highlight the microphone click on properties and you can see that the microphone properties windows is open and there's a couple things I want you to check to make sure they're set properly. Under custom you'll see something called AGC or possibly APC or mic boost, you want to make sure that box is checked. For the level, you want to make sure that the microphone is set about 50. Maybe 60 if you're soft spoken, but 50 is a good range uh, for you to be in. Uh, make sure that this isn't muted, or the microphone's not muted. To mute the mic, you'll see by clicking on it, a little red circle appears and that mutes the mic. So once these settings are set, go ahead and click OK. The USB is set as the default device and everything should be working properly. If it's still not working, please give tech support a call. You can reach us at area code 360-823-4127. Hopefully this video was helpful for you.